Take a look at the Grand Exchange Market Movers section, and you'll notice different items that have spiked recently in value, one of which was the Grenwall Spikes. Used as a second ingredient in extreme ranging potions, Grenwall Spikes are commonly traded and known for having a decent gilling rate, but as of recently, this has jumped up considerably. Going back to the Grand Exchange chart for the Grenwall Spikes, we'll notice a market increase of 50% in the last month alone, leading me to believe that Grenwall Spikes might have even been selling for more than market, which is currently set at 800 92 a piece, more than 600 GP each than they were about five months ago. With this thinking in mind, I figured I'd go out and hunt some Grenroll spikes to find out just how many I get per hour and possibly make some decent profit as well. So that being said, let's go for the hunt and see how many Grenroll spikes I received. This is not a guide for Grenroll hunting, but a brief rundown of how I hunted for Grenroll spikes. I suppose should be stated. Having completed the medium turban task set allows players to hunt Grenrolls without the use of bait, which made my hunting a whole lot easier. I brought five traps with me and went over to the Grenwall hunting area in Tierwin. I hunted fairly casually and with more attention being made, I'm sure you could surpass my Grenwall spikes hunted per hour. After one hour of hunting Grenwalls, I did end up with just under 1900 spikes collected, along with a fair amount of herbs as well, all of which sold for about 1.9 mil in pure profit. The Grenwall spikes, like I thought, did sell for over mid price in the Grand Exchange, coming in at about 902 GP apiece, seemingly to be on the rise still. Seeing these numbers leads to the conclusion that the Grenwall hunting currently is profitable at about 2 million GP per hour, which makes it a fairly good money maker for mid-level players. Of course, you need the tier win medium task set done for my method, along with the 77 hunter requirement to hunt for Grenwalls themselves, all fairly easily achieved within the game. There are other methods for hunting Grenwalls without the use of the task sets that require the use of raw polya for bait, which should not hold you back from making nearly 2 mil per hour as well, or the use of the private hunting areas from participating participating with Big Chin Champa. That's it for this video. Hopefully somebody will get some use out of this skilling money making method while it lasts. Any questions or comments feel free to post down below and I'm pretty sure this will stick around until the next bonus XP weekend and I'll see you in the next one.